screen got so wet, it shorted or something. I don't know what it did. there with all that rain Whew. got wet for a minute doggone rain messed up my camera this year blowed up a wind i know that hey mid south first and second and the only one it looks like I don't know if I did that or what. I tried to put that uh, plastic bag over the camera uh, to keep it from getting too wet. And next thing I know, it shut off. But rain's just about to blow out. Hopefully. Hey, Bullets, appreciate you coming back, buddy. Make sure no water in y'all's way. There we go. Oh, it's so dark. Some up there. Lighten it up. Take it away and get dark. Come on, man. What are you doing, StreamYard? The rod moving. I'm not paying attention to rods. What are you talking about? Oh, that's the wind blowing that one. I'm running my yapper, wasn't paying any attention. Could have been something floating by. Whatever it was, it got hooked on the bottom. And when I pulled it, broke. That's all right. I need to put a little heavier weight on there anyway. This gives me the opportunity. Old man eyes. Want to get some of that colored, brightly colored line. I can't already see this clear line. No, it's not clear. It's never clear. Whatever it is, I can't see the crap.
Gonna lose it anyway. Gonna be in the rough. Most likely. And this is a light tip for us. I got a whole lot of excuses, don't I? All right. Let's see what that was. I think I heard my other phone ding laying at me. Probably the wife. Poor work. No? I thought, I thought I heard a ding. All right. Well, we got five people back in here. Uh, well, it's a barbecue. When I'm fishing down here at the river, because you're going to lose so much gear. I like using a three-way with a real lightweight line on my weight. Uh, I mean, it's just a given. You're going to lose your weight. She's 80% of the time you throw out down here. So I only put a 10-pound line on my weight. And then uh, on the leader going to my hook, I put a 30-pound a down here. When I'm up on the lake, I don't even use the three-way. I just do a, a weight at the bottom with a couple of dropper loops for hooks on it. That's what I got on these other two. Because I had them out on the lakes this weekend. Let me see. Did I miss anybody? First rods moving. Yeah, they always twitch and move. Doggone things drive me nuts, Miss Sal. There's Anthony. He made her back. All right. Let's see. This one right here. Kind of in the way of the other three. I have a good place to tilt it. Look that up. Good place to tilt it like the other two. That's a little bit better, but now y'all can't see. I can't see that one either. Go. What we got? Many dang Asian carp moving around in here today. It's probably with Asian carp in my mind. I don't know if you've been seeing them or snagging them down there at uh, Methuen. Man, they're here thick today. Which swivel I do I tie the weight to? Let's see. I'll show you how I do it. Now, I don't know. I'm not professional with this, dude. No professional by any means. Right or wrong, that's how I do it. I get these at uh, Bass Pro Shop. They're 150 pound swivel. There's no one doggone Asian carts flopping. These swivels. Let me turn if I got this. Dead gum. Maybe I'll try to hold the tip up. There, they're uh, 
look, there's one straight up and down, or two straight up and down and one out to the side. So I tie the one going up to my line to my pole. I tie the one to the bottom to my uh, sinker. And the one that goes out to the side is where I put my hook on. If that's what you were asking, if I understood that right. Hey, Johnny Small Pepper, what's up, buddy? I appreciate you listening in. You only listen to professional skipjack fishermen. Well, you are up the creek if you're trying to find one of them here. I'm a hack. I don't know why I keep putting those sunglasses on. I can't see squat with them on. That's exactly what you were asking. Good deal, buddy. Did I miss anybody there? I don't think so. I think I got them on. I'm notorious for leaving stuff on the riverbank. Speaking of that, Anthony, Kevin gives me no love. I showed him that rig all oh, now. I know you were using it, but I've used that rig for years now. I didn't ever use that real light line on the bottom, though, until you showed me that. That, right, that light line was your idea. I'll give you credit on that one. Being a professional fisherman, 80% pain and 20% joy. Well, the way I roll around on these rocks down here, it's definitely 80% pain. Well, definitely happened on that one down there, but it's not big enough to cause any trouble. That wasn't something just bumping. I don't know, dude. We'll get out on the boat soon. With the weather getting nice, Jennifer's going to be fighting you for a spot on the boat. I like his. I'm not sure what you mean there. Bullet. <laughs> as soon as I recover from the last time I took you out, I'll call you. I hear you. No. We need to go out soon. Uh, fish ought to, catfish ought to turn on them. I don't know, I hear they're, they're on fire on the Ohio right now. Dominic, I was talking to him last night. If y'all watch uh, Dominic Hollis, let's see, to the sinkers. I run. This is a trilene big game. Uh, I said 10 pound earlier, I think it's 12 pounds. You know, that's why I run to the sinker. Here anyway, just because it's so, you know, you're going to lose the sinkers. Me too, Johnny. Taps here, but nothing wants to take it on down. Uh -oh. Uh oh, come on. You're trying down there on the end. It's just a hundred of them doggone Asian carp swimming by bumping my line constantly. Ooh, Anthony throws out 18 ounce weights. He's throwing them heavy weights. I don't know if I got a, a fishing pole heavy enough to throw 18 ounces. I'm all done. Take it back. I do have one pole I can probably throw that on. Probably 
probably need that in the Ohio, though, don't you? Yeah, that's right. Jason Hill Jr. That one I've got. I guess you would call it a semi-V. Uh, it's flat bottom to get to the very front. It kind of comes up to a V. I don't really know what you call that. It's not a V, but a semi-V at the front. I've had a few of the flat bottom John boats over the years, and they will definitely beat you to death if you're in some waves. That one of mine doesn't ride the smoothest. It's heavy, but it doesn't cut through them like you would think. Asian carp for bait, just the place to be today. <laughs> yeah, you're right there, Anthony. Five foot swells, it don't matter what you got. Time of year, I tell you, the pollen stuff on the roof gets my eyes tore up. As many of these birds as we got feeding in here, there shouldn't be any bait fish left. Time, I'm gonna see if we're just getting jacked up this way. Just anybody there. Just a pass of time. By the time I get this, uh, get a skipjack on, the holes will double over. Not a pepper grower, but we got the garden tilled up this last weekend. Put a second. Oh, that dude jerked it right out of his mouth. One hit it. All right, Kevin, you're not setting the hook in an eight pound bass. Sir Johnny, my stomach does not agree with peppers or anything spicy or acidic anymore. I am 50 years old, and 
if I eat anything like that, I don't sleep that night. I used to really enjoy, oh, there's one. I used to really enjoy that kind of stuff. Not anymore. There's one skippy skippy. All right, we're going to send him back. We don't need him. Let's fish in front of him. Now, some of these catfish will start biting. I might have to keep one or two of them. Yeah. Hook myself. There's a pretty minnow. That's about what it looked like with A little bitty old skip jet. Right on, sir. All right now, sunshine. That means y'all need to bite. Somebody needs to bite. That was a dead gum Asian carp I had smacked. Glad he came off. Messed up my messed up my jig. The skipjack were biting, I really thought the catfish would be biting this evening. I'll catch up to y'all in just a second. I can't read that screen with these sunglasses. Johnny, I hope to see you back sometime soon. I've been missing your live. You have to be, get back to live soon. It must have just been one skipjack down here. I take it back. I did hit. I did hook one. Oh, yeah, I don't know. That one earlier, I said I hooked the ink out of his mouth. That could have been Asian carp, I suppose. Dude in that boat. 
definitely cranking waves this way. Anthony, you saying Johnny switched to Instagram? Is he an Instagram model now? The bike. Oh, I'm gonna step down past that far one. See if anything the bike down that way. What that means is once I get down here, one of these is gonna get a bike. Well, no skip jack. That bar one sure was an eight point something was playing with it. When I picked it up, there was nothing there. Let me see if I can play catch up here. Find you on this phone. It's easier to catch up.
Come on, Kevin, find yourself. There we go. All right, I guess I am caught up. Y'all aren't very chatty this afternoon. But we got 10 people in here watching. I appreciate y'all hanging out. There's a big old Asian carp just floated by a dead one and a big uh, grass carp floated right behind it. I don't see too many of those grass carp up here. Tony, you've you been catching some lately down there at Smithland Dam, haven't you? Tell y'all what, I didn't bring snacks or anything. It's 6.05, we're going to give her to 6.15 because my belly's saying it's supper time. If nothing bites by 6.15, we're going to call it a day. At least I didn't get skunked. I caught a skipjack, a baby skipjack, but he's still skipjack. I need to bring my snacks down here with me and stay one night after dark. See what I want to play. I ain't done that in quite a while. I'm like a little kid. You got to pack snacks for me. I get hungry. Anthony been catching giant ones. I thought so. Big ones. What ball game are you watching? Are you a... Uh, Pirates fan or Phillies fan? I know they've got no snacks. That's a terrible thing. You ask Anthony, he's been out on the boat and he knows I gotta have snacks on the boat too. And he says, everything is, di is giant down there. Now. They ain't. There ain't no giants right here. If they are, they should not bite. Except for that big Asian carpet just smacked his tail. There goes another grass carp right there for them. What's killing them grass carp like that? That's abnormal. San Francisco got a baseball team. I didn't know they even played baseball anymore. I can't say anything. I'm a Cardinals fan. Playing the Phillies. I know. For some unknown reason, the radio station close to my house, I'm way closer to St. Louis than I am to Atlanta or to Cincinnati. But the radio stations around my house only carry Cincinnati Reds and Atlanta ball game. When I'm up this way close to work, I can pick up some Cardinals ball game. But our west of here. Oh, 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 oh. You may have a taker. Come on. You can do it or not. Maybe get up.
He just be jumped floating around under the water. Then something was messing with him. And we're just sitting on the phone with that right there. Now, Mid South, it's been trying to move down there, but I really think it's maybe more all these Asian carp in here that keep hitting. I may be wrong. That one on the far end and this one here has super light tips. It doesn't take much of anything to make them move. That's why I don't jump a lot because, I mean, just the least little thing makes those tips jerk like you've got something going on. You see it down there right now. It's just twitching away, but I don't think there's anything on it. Well, I know there's nothing on it. I don't know what that is. Current thing or current hitting it. Another fish hitting it. I don't know. Well, we got five minutes. Five minutes. Come on, fish. I need a catfish. You got fresh, super fresh skin jacket. No reason not to take a bite. I'm going to start bringing night crawlers, I guess. Give them something else to eat. See him yanking, jerking, playing on, playing around down there. He doing nothing. Nothing, nothing. Yeah, that looks that was a jerk. I see him. He's twitching here too. Come on, one of you boys pull on over. This little twitch don't do it. Oh, 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 oh. Now, doggone, you made me stand up. Come on. It just made me want to get up. Yeah, you're good. I thought I had a fish. You use the TV app. It's free for baseball games. What app are you using? Is it like the ESPN app or which app? Down there. It says go to streamcast.com. Has all the sports and fights for free. No kidding. Streamcast. I'll have to check that out.
I used to really enjoy baseball, but I hadn't watched much last year. Been fishing so much that I was fishing when most of the game, or well, during my time off, I was fishing usually when the games were. I used to really enjoy going to St. Louis to the ball game. I went to a couple games up at Cincinnati too. That was a pretty nice stadium. All right, guys, I think I'm going to start reeling her in. I'd say we're time. Well, we got one more minute. I'm a little early. A little early. One more minute. Hear that fish? I may have fished this spot a little too much, too, on YouTube. I see a lot of people fishing down here. That may be part of the problem. I want us to move on down the bank. Nice big polar crest. All right, I'm going to start reeling her in. My stomach says it's supper time. I'm going to fish it on credit. Well, bait speed has been extra down Like he came loose, look with no weight. No, no, look my weight. All right, y'all, let me shut her down. I appreciate y'all hanging out with me. Even though we're up to 11 people now that I'm shutting everything down. Uh, we didn't catch anything but one little skipjack on camera. Caught a bunch of skipjack earlier before I started fishing. Down here in Parkley, skipjack are doing pretty good. Y'all needing any? Come on down. Get my bag put together. Pack all my stuff back so I don't leave anything on the bank. 
and I'm notorious for that phone charging cord. Won't be long. No Creole muskrat will be on. Y'all be sure and check them out. Seven o'clock. I said I was going to shut that down, didn't I? I don't guess I did. Put my poles to the hook. I forgot. I have some re rigging to do before I come fishing again. I lost everything. That's right. That is part of the game, especially down here today. All right, y'all. That's everything but the camera. I appreciate y'all hanging out with me this evening. We'll catch y'all next time. I'll talk to you later. Thank you.